Um, I'm still trying to discover that. Uh, um, Jeff Goldblum is here, so I'm trying to uh, use him as the the fashion guy. He's he's the model that I, I he's the one that I aspire to be one day. Obviously, I would not be able to pull off what he can pull off. Uh, when you see him tonight, he looks spectacular. So apparently, I just have a man crush on him, or just man crush, just crush crush. I love that guy. I've hugged him three times since I've been here. I just can't stop hugging him. He's just wonderful. Yeah. Well, I was looking at old pictures of myself from an album that I found recently, and I always liked, um, I was always interested in dressing up, you know. I think I saw Sammy Davis Jr. Uh, on television wear a Nehru jacket and a turtleneck and a medallion and I got my mom to take me shopping and there was some kind of cheap version of that at the department store by that time and I said I want that uh, and I wore it, I have pictures of myself in that. Anyway, then when I discovered acting and working from not only the inside out but the outside in and how a certain shoe made you feel and walk and all that, I got very interested in it. I'm still waiting to discover fashion, so maybe, maybe tonight's the night or sometime soon. Yeah, this is like uh, I'm, you know, I tried, but this is here. Pan over here. This is like, that's like, that's how you do it. Not compared to, I mean, I couldn't pull that off. I think I've been a pretty uh, adept of fashion since I was like a kid. I've always loved fashion and I always wanted to try and experiment with, with cool things. So um, I don't think that, that's going to die anytime soon. And you can do all of it. I feel like I was diving into fashion so young that, thank God, my mom was like, it's fine, let them look like that. I probably looked crazy because I would wear the most out. I grew up watching my mom get changed for shows and sequins. And so I love like, I love like random stuff like sequence coats and all kind. Like people probably, most parents probably be like, you can't wear that to school. And she'd be like, yeah, wear it. So I may have looked crazy at the time, but I feel like my mom always told me, she was like, you dictate fashion, you know, you set the trend. And so I've always felt that way. I felt like as a human being, like speaking from your heart and what you love and fashion is so, nowadays it used to be so much where like men couldn't wear certain things and women could wear all these amazing outfits and now I feel like we're in a place where like I, I, I borrow clothes from my wife and I do certain like I, I, I think it's, it's such a it's, we're in such a beautiful place where there is no gender to clothing and I, I, I'm a fan of that. How many more? Two. Two?